Hey guys, hope everybody is doing well. Today we are going to see how to create a master clean plate in Silhouette. Here I have a footage. I am going to create a session by dragging that footage into the node graph. Write a name here, clean plate. Choose a, a template. Click on this OK. So here we have the footage loaded inside Silhouette and we have the paint node and output node default. Here you can see the image has been catched. Now okay so if you check the footage we have some defocus artifacts in this footage now i'm gonna do a cleanup for that area for that what we can do is like we can create a master clean plate in the last frame uh, because we have this focused island in the first frame so take the paint settings take the clone tool okay in clone tool we can match the first frame into last frame using uh, onion skin overlay okay so here we have the options just turn on turn it on okay and click on the first frame or keep it as the first frame as the source now give it as a hundred opacity now i'm gonna match this first frame i mean this area of the first frame i mean this island of the first frame into the last frame of the footage so that i can create a master clean plate and do a prep thereafter so this a tutorial is purely for explaining or just guiding you how to uh, create a master clean plate by extending the project settings so i have matched almost this area now i'm going to take the clone tool and just clone it okay so what what it does is like i'm not able to clone uh, the area which is beyond the project settings or uh, the bounding box so we need to extend this uh, settings or project settings for that just go into the transform and just take the dod node and connect to that into the footage so we have some sort of adjustments uh, bounding box here just adjust the settings this side because we need some data to be filled there okay it's not happening so after this we need to do one important step to get it extended so click on this roi option inside this we can see the dod settings as well as we have the session size and uh, we have an option here to copy the dod option into the session size click on this option yep now we can see some black areas in the footage which we can use to extend the clean plate okay now we have already matched the clean plate of first frame into last frame so let's paint it yep now we can create a master clean plate by extending the project settings there is some issues in the color like it's not perfectly matched but we need to create a master clean plate by just doing some tweaks here okay so yep the quality is not that much good i know that but if you're doing a production quality make sure you're using this idea and the quality is absolutely good okay now we have created a clean plate here now let's uh, render this and take into nuke so click on the output node here i have set the path for the uh, file needs to be rendered and just click on this rgb because we are gonna render an rgb clean plate here we have an important option like crop uncheck that crop option and just take the render se uh, settings here we have an option like render roi render and now let's go into nuke and let's check okay we have the footage here okay so you can see the project settings just set the actual project settings of the footage inside the project settings and just try to import the clean plate yep it's done so thank you guys for following this tutorial i hope this is useful